Greg, welcome to RSNA 2012. Thank you. Um, as you know, the uh, theme at RSNA this year is patience first. And uh, even Dr. Bissett with the opening keynote today talks about the value of radiology and being more in front of the patients. What are your thoughts on that? Uh, you know, you, you've, you've been around for a while, you've published certain different, a lot of different articles. What are your thoughts? Well, patience first, uh, I, it's a great theme and I think that it's shown its importance throughout the history of, of radiology where the impact that patients can have can be uh, really quite, uh, quite great. And we go back into the 1990s when we looked at how patient uh, comfort was a big issue, whereas in MR, there, most people who had been uh, designing those MR scanners for a long time had really been considering that, uh, well, claustrophobia has only affected maybe a um, single digit uh, percentage of the patients and it's nothing to be concerned about. But open MR really caught on and it was the patients that drove open MR. So if you look at patients, uh, the effect that they can have, it's really great. So what, what kind of an effect can patients have today? And I think that one way to do it is to involve them with the data and I think uh, involve consumers, uh, the increasing awareness of uh, healthcare and the uh, strength that the internet brings to data search and finding information uh, is a great opportunity. Absolutely, and um, you know, and this year at RSNA, we have. I'm really, really excited to release my view, the patient portal uh, for imaging data and reports. And you've had some uh, early look at this, um, and and you know, looking at the market out there. You know, what are your thoughts on? our imaging portal and, and what's out there today? Well, it, it's a very simple portal, one that people don't have to put a lot of effort into uh, learning how to use. It's intuitive, and, and when I say intuitive, I mean uh, you can look at it and just see what needs to be, what's available, what you need to do in order to access that data, and that's what I like about it most is that it's very simple. Now, uh, what it will actually do is, is provide the data and the interpretation then still has to come from the radiologist or the or the um, uh, general practitioner, that primary care physician. But then it still involves the radiologist at a level that hasn't been uh, available before then. So what my view does is it opens the door. Now what will happen in the future is hard to say, but it provides the opportunity to gain access to your own data and then ask radiologists or ask the primary care physician what this means or how does it relate to them. So it starts a dialogue. Mm -hmm. Absolutely, yeah. And you know, our early studies certainly show that. You know, the 50% engagement we've seen in Houston Medical Imaging, and um, and the very little IT that's required to support that certainly backs up the this whole patient engagement trend that we're seeing. So absolutely great. Well, thank you so much, and we appreciate you stopping by. Thank you.